just inside my name. The spotlight this month is on African American music. It was 42 years ago that uh, this week that President Jimmy Carter declared June as the month of black music. And here to explain how Delmarva is celebrating is the music director of Taylor Music Studios. This is Christy Taylor. Christy, by the way, is also the sister of Milton Native and founder of the Equal Justice Initiative, Brian Stevenson. Christy, thank you for being here this afternoon. I'm so glad to be here with you. Thank you. We were talking uh, about the the uh, Brian Allen Stevenson School of Excellence yesterday yes. and talking about a fundraising event. We're going to talk about that, how you, that's all connected with what you're talking about in a few moments. But Thank first, you. I want to talk about the roots of African American music. There's a deep history to it, isn't there? There is. It's uh, long, and um, I'm really excited that, you know, just 42 years ago, we started recognizing how we celebrate uh, all cultures, but particularly music, you know, in February we, we dedicate some of the, uh, the that month to uh, lifting up history and uh, as well as Jazz Month, Women in, 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 in Music, that uh, this month is special because we do get an opportunity to do celebrations and uh, African heritage is really important, you know, when we think about from spirituals, work songs, plantation songs, and then to the art form of spirituals and what they meant at, around the world until popular music. It's been really exciting to see the growth and the exposure for the diversity uh, in our culture and music. So I imagine you think it's important we have an entire month devoted. Oh definitely. I think every month should be all the things that we can do when we talk about um, public schools and their response to um, African American music and the exposure for young people to learn but also in our community how we can come together and celebrate. There's Juneteenth and we have lots of opportunities for us to express music in those kinds of celebrations as well. Now as we mentioned you have uh, Taylor Music. Tell us about your music. Thank you. I've been um, a micro business for some years now and I teach uh, in coastal Delaware. We offer uh, both group and private lessons for most every instrument. Uh, I'm blessed to have a nice uh, group of students all ages and we provide rental instruments and we do some recording as well. Mm, that's neat. Okay, so we have some upcoming events and this is the connection that we were telling you about because you are going to be, one of them is for the, the Brian Allen Stevenson School yes, of Excellence. Yes, you know, uh, we, we founded the vision based on the principles of uh, the great work my brother has done over the years and it inspired us to come and create something that would be purposeful in the Sussex community for all kids you know we're looking at it at a high school level and starting with uh, the ninth and tenth grades and so to, to support that we need some funding and so we have a big fundraiser coming up at the end of the month we're really grateful uh, for the opportunity to have it in such a wonderful location, which is Sydney's uh, uh, restaurant in Milton, Delaware. It's a brand new restaurant that's been around even in the midst of COVID. And it's, uh, they're classmates of ours and it's, they happen to be African-American owners. We're so proud of what they're doing in the community. And it's a perfect setting for our fundraiser. Uh, we have it scheduled for Sunday. June 27th from 2 to 5. Uh, the event is on Eventbrite. Uh, it's selling out quickly, mm -hmm. so people should come. But the focus of that is actually a gospel concert, uh, jazz uh, kind of mixture with some artists that are coming in. And we have some special videos from both my brothers, which will be exciting. And so Taylor Music Studios is presenting this and supporting it in, in, in support of the school, Brian Allison Stevenson School of Excellence. Uh, you have to be, I mean, it's just amazing how you're all coming together yeah. in this community. Well, we should be. Yeah. This is the time, you know, after COVID, we've learned so a lot of things. And per part of that is to have purposeful living, but connecting with people and seeing so cultural arts are something that's really important. We can see in all of our communities the diversity of that. We should be celebrating each, uh, each, uh, each culture, really. Yeah, and you guys are doing a great job of making sure that happens. Christy Taylor, thank the you. music director of Taylor Music Studios, thank you so much oh, for you. spending some time with us this thank afternoon. You. Thank you.